Tom and Fujibas, welcome to this brand new cookery studio at Abel and Cole. And alongside me, the lovely Rachel de Dampel. How are you, Rachel? Yeah, I'm good, thanks. You're good? Nice, yeah. Cardi. Thank you, you too. I think we coordinated. <laughs> I think somebody should have given me a phone call this morning to see what they were wearing. Uh, we're going to do a really cool recipe. Um, these fellas here, of course, you know them, they're squid. And we're going to do a really lovely chilli salt and pepper squid that we're going to show you how to prepare uh, and cook. There's hardly anything to it, but it's an absolutely brilliant ingredient. But why are we doing squid? Well, one reason we're doing squid is because we um, have expanded our fish range. Um, so we have lots of beautiful things, including this lovely squid. Um, and also, I'm here for a free lesson from you. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go in front of the eyes. Okay, so that's the first cut that we do. Sharp knife, fingers out of the way. Cool, and then we've got this body that is attached internally to this outer casing. This is the thing that we want, so everything inside is going to come out. But get the best part of it in your hands, and you're kind of, with a little bit of effort, you should get this sort of unappetizing, oh <laughs> uh, sort of squid snotty internal <laughs> bit, right? Do we have surprisingly no use for whatsoever? This? What is that? That's amazing. What is that? It's That's like a it. bit of packaging. It does, doesn't it? In fact, yours has come out in one go. And there's the rest of mine. Absolutely stunning. So we've now got this uh, kind of body, which is still containing a little bit of that goo. Yeah. Um, let's just trim the end off so you've kind of got now a funnel. Yeah. And we're going to just rinse this through a cold running tap. Uh, we have now been left with this body, and it's got this kind of really nice but sort of interfering skin on it that you just want to get in there and peel back. Do we want to take the wings off? Yeah. Pinch them together. Yeah. Get your finger fingers yeah. underneath and then just pull them off. Uh, so I'm going to just cut those in two and then the, this is the trickiest bit. Yeah. We're talking about seafood and I don't know where, and you must be able to hear the rain lashing yes. down. It's like being on the set of Perfect Storm. Absolutely. I mean where's George Clooney when you need him? Yeah. Uh, but <laughs> we're going to continue properties. because we're heroes of the sea. Uh, there are hard bits on these tentacles that I'm just going to, if you run them through your fingers, you don't want to be chewing down on something no. like that. When we're at that point, we've got this little thing to contend with. This is the beak, this is the mouth. Squeeze that out of there. And if I can, just, can you see it? Yeah, how extraordinary. So, these are our kind of main components. This is now all in the realms of edible. I've got a griddle pan here that I'm just gonna, let's get it really stinking hot. Yeah, absolutely. Really smoky. It keeps it from sticking, doesn't it? Yeah, exactly. We're gonna open this up, actually. It doesn't matter where you cut it, Richard, but yeah. there's a kind of visual yes. line there, a kind of seam very much like between the two yeah. wings. If we just follow that line down, if we sort of cut this, it, it relaxes it, up, yeah. opens it up. About a centimetre? Uh, I'm doing it before. Yeah, yeah, whatever takes you fancy really. I mean, you could put your signature in there if you wanted. <laughs> I'm going in. Alright, I'm going in. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So, let it sit in there, let it get the, the colour on it. Um, there's really no danger of overcooking that. Let's get the wings on the side. Haven't scored these. So we've got a little bit of colour on there. We've got a little bit of colour on there. That's kind of sticking. I'm going to put this in. And now, a uh, little bit of uh, chilli oil. Chilli oil. Yeah, it's going to go on. 
Okay? Lovely. Right. Mm -hmm. And so if we have to vacate the premises because it gets a little bit too hot and spicy, so be it. Nice bit of colour on that. And I'm really sorry to keep you waiting. You're a chef, I'm not a chef. A chef has a particular way of putting on salt. It doesn't help that I'm cut. Yeah, no, more height, more height. Yeah. That's it, that's it. <laughs> yeah, it's got to go from over the head. Lovely. What do you reckon? Do you think we're thereabouts? And pop that there. Uh, but I'm going to just. Okay, and then we're going to salt and pepper it. Yeah, so, wings. Mm, they're delicious. You never get these in a restaurant. What is that? I don't know. You get skate wings. That's true. It's no chewiness whatsoever. Yeah, that's you true. You can eat it on camera without being really intimidated by it. That's it's nice. It's lovely. It's really, oh, really good. Like yeah. To cook some more. I mean, the seasoning's a bit off, but you can't win every time, can you? Do you know what I mean? Um, it's not it's perfect. Mm. If you like this recipe, then send us your comments. If you don't like it, send them to her. Uh, <laughs> but uh, we're going to do loads of stuff. This is a new thing. We're going to be working with Abel and Cole in this fantastic studio. We're going to be loads more recipes coming up in the future. Uh, what you should do is keep subscribed to the FoodTube channel. Look out for more recipes. Rachel, thanks very much. Yeah, thanks. Cheers.